As I walked down the path, something followed my every step. I looked back to see them. Clear as day, footprints staining the ground. Yet, these are not my footprints. Each step I, with each step I take, I look back. Some more of those mocking footprints still follow me. I break into a run, but they follow me still. They're not my footprints. I run into the, my garden and close the gate, locking it tight as I step back again. Those footprints followed me. My heart raced as fear gripped my mind. They're not my footprints. I rush into my home and shut the door, once again looking up as I slid off my shoes and take each step on the wooden floor. As soon as my foot makes contact with the floor, my hope dashes as another footprint appears behind, different from before, yet still there, its presence burning at me like hot coals even there, even here, in the comfort of my own home. They follow me, haunting me. I let out a scream, run across the wooden floor and up the stairs, glancing back at horror at those horrid footprints following me. An army of them dotted across the floor and ascending the stairs. I hail unnatural stains upon my very being. They're not my footprints. I can't take it any longer. It won't let me get away. I won't let them win. I run with all my might to my room and leap out my window. The pain of glass shattering. The rush of terror as I fell. Then darkness. I wake up in a bed surrounded by doctors and nurses. They say I am lucky to be alive. But one of them informed me I have broken my spine. I will never walk again. I smile as a wave of relief passes over me. The doctor looks a little confused. But I don't care. I start to laugh a little. Making, which makes the nurse raise her eyebrows a little as they ask if I'm okay. Everyone is worried, but I'm not. I won. I finally won. No more footprints. I'm free.